Michigan, this November 8th, you have the right to choose. And your choice will decide whether we wake up in a better Michigan or a Michigan that has been radically transformed. Help me understand what's going on with you. You're just not yourself lately. Mom. Two weeks ago, I had an abortion. What? How? How? How is that possible? You're only 14. Your doctor didn't even tell me. My teacher said they wouldn't have to anymore since Prop 3 passed. I didn't know. I just don't understand why my son wants to sterilize himself and there's nothing I can do about it. What do you mean there's nothing you can do? He's only 10 and you're his mother. Prop 3 passed and gave every individual the right to effectuate decisions about sterilization. His teacher told him that if he wants to transition, he can do this. There's nothing I can do. If he decides to go through with it, it's his choice. I didn't know. Thanks very much for coming in. Look in all the tests. Everything's going fine. Baby is very, very healthy. But I need to ask you, before we go any further, are you sure this child is not going to cause you any mental health issues? Fear, anxiety, stress? I mean, it's my fourth kid, so probably. <laughs> well, if you feel that way, we can terminate this pregnancy for you. How is that possible? Well, now the Proposition 3 has passed, you know you have the right to terminate this pregnancy up to the time of a birth. Really? Yes, if it would be advisable for the protection of your mental health. I didn't know. You are the county prosecutor. My 15-year-old granddaughter is dead, and you tell me you can't do anything to the person who killed her? I understand your frustration, but since Proposition 3 passed, the state shall not penalize, prosecute, or otherwise take adverse action against someone for aiding or assisting a pregnant individual in exercising their right to reproductive freedom with their voluntary consent. There's just nothing I can do. I didn't know. Hey babe, how was your day? What's wrong? I, um, I had to perform an abortion today. What? How, how is that even possible? You work for a Catholic hospital. And um, Prop 3 passed and gave the mother the right to make and um, uh, effectuate all abortion and postpartum care decisions. And um, she chose us and we had to comply. I had to comply. It was her right. I didn't know. Michigan, Proposition 3 is dangerous for parental rights, religious liberties, our children, the unborn, the newly born, the preyed upon, and the abused. It's permanent and goes way beyond Roe. Proposition 3 is dangerous for our state, for our culture, and for our society. This November 8th, Vote no to protect human life in all its forms. Vote no to protect the vulnerable. Vote no to protect parental rights. 
religious liberties, and medical and prosecutorial rights. Choose to give your child a Michigan and a future they deserve. On November 9th, don't wake up saying, I didn't know. Choose to vote no on Prop 3, because now you know.